Here's the video on how to enable Oti and Touch ID on Remitano. To enable Oti on Remitano, the first step is to go to the top bar and select your username and then click on settings. Then from settings, you can go to enable Oti authentication. Authentication, this Oti authentication is the two-factor authentication. So you can use the Oti app itself or use Google Authenticator, but we encourage you to use Oti app because it allows you to move your profile and the app itself from one device to another in case you change your device. And you can also have multiple devices for your authenticator. So the first step is to click on enable and then you have this barcode to scan. Then before you copy, before you are able to scan this barcode, you need to have the authenticator app on your device so the next step is to go to the app store and then search for OT. so you click on OT and then you install OT on your device now the next step would be to add a new account if you are using the desktop, then you can scan with the scanner. So after scanning, it will automatically copy the authenticator key and then you can rename your account and then save. Now then the next step will be for you to copy the OT token into your Remitano account. And then you can enable OT. And then OT is enabled. So you cannot you, you cannot perform certain things without this OT, like transferring your coin out or releasing the trade. You need OT to do that. So that's how you enable OT with your computer and phone on a channel. To disable OT on your computer. First, click on the Disable button. If you have your OTI app, then you need to enter the code from your device, from your OTI device. So the code at the moment is this. And then you click on Disable, and it will be disabled automatically. Now, to disable OTI, when you do not have your OTI anymore, probably you displaced your OTI app or your phone, you click on Lost OTI, and then... You read the instructions and take a picture, a selfie picture, holding this particular instruction, copying this instruction and writing it on a sheet of paper and then hold it and take a selfie and show that your elbow shows. Then you upload it. Then you upload it on your Remitano profile. When you do that, you receive this message that we have received your request to disable OT authentication. Please wait for confirmation. So after, you need to keep your mobile phone on because Remitano will give you a call. And after you are able to confirm that you are the owner of the account, then your OT will be disabled. Here is a tutorial on how to set up OT app on Remitano with your mobile device. The first step is to download the Remitano app from the Play Store or from your iStore if you are using an iPhone. So you search for your Remitano app and then this is it. You can also search for your Hoti app and this is it. So you open the Hoti app and get ready to set up the authentication on Remitano. The next step is to proceed to your Remitano app and then locate the settings portion now from the settings you click on enable OT for OT authentication enable now because we are using an app we cannot scan this barcode so the next step is to copy the authentication key and paste it in the OT app so you click on these three dots and add an account 
and then you enter code manually and then you paste the auto key and then you save after saving it you will be prompted to search the logo of the app so the app is Remitano you can select this logo and then click on continue you can give it a name Remitano and then the app is ready so you copy this code and then you paste this code in your Remitano app and then you click on enable and then the OT authentication has been enabled now to disable it you can disable it in two ways if you want to disable you click on disable and then you enter the code from the OT app and then you paste it in this portion and click on disable it will be disabled so that is how to disable it. Now to disable your OT app, you click on disable. If you don't have the OT authentication, you click on lost your OT and then you follow the instructions by writing down confirm disable OT at remtaro.com with the day, the month and the year. So if today was 1st of December 2020, that's what you write there. And then you upload the pic, you take a selfie and upload the picture and then when you do so so let's assume this is the picture the upload has been done so Romitano will inform you that we received your request to disable auto authentication please wait for confirmation so you have to wait for confirmation for that now here is a video on search ID the first step is to click on the menu button and then select settings the second step is to locate your touch id section and then the next step will be to click on enable touch id add your fingerprint then enter your code from your OT app And then click on enable touch id the touch id is already enabled to disable touch id you click on lost touch id and then you follow the instruction by writing down confirm disable touch or face id at remitano.com and then with date month and year and then you upload the picture and then remitano will call you to confirm this before disabling.